Only Nelcore Respiration Rate software uses your existing technology, sensors and workflows to derive respiration rate based on the changes in the pulse oximetry signal that occur as a result of breathing. The act of breathing is controlled by central respiratory drive. The brain sends a spontaneous and subconscious signal to activate the breathing muscles. This initiates a series of actions that affect the pleth waveform or the photoplethysmogram waveform derived from a pulse oximeter. Nelcor respiration rate software is based on central respiratory drive rather than an indication of airflow. During inspiration, the diaphragm contracts, which decreases intrathoracic pressure. As the intrathoracic pressure decreases, venous return increases, left ventricular stroke volume decreases, and heart rate increases. These changes in the cardiovascular, respiratory, and autonomic nervous systems result in changes in the pleth waveform modulations. These can now be used to calculate respiration rate. The corresponding changes to the pleth waveform during inspiration can take different forms. As venous return increases, blood in the extremities is redistributed back to the core. This change is reflected in a decrease in the baseline modulation of the pleth waveform. The decrease in stroke volume is reflected in a decrease in the amplitude modulation, or the height of the pleth waveform. And as heart rate increases, the frequency modulation, or the distance between pleth waveform peaks, decreases. During expiration, the reverse physiological and corresponding pleth waveform changes occur. The Nelcor respiration rate algorithm software uses these changes in the pleth waveform to calculate respiration rate with the same sensors and technology that you use to monitor pulse oximetry. Every five seconds, the algorithm reviews the baseline, amplitude, and frequency modulation pleth waveform averages of the previous 45 seconds. Over time, these averages are converted to a weighted average. With continuous monitoring, the algorithm responds to the weighted averages of the individual patient. Importantly, changes associated with patient movement, blood pressure, or other anomalies may be identified as signal interference and will be ignored by the algorithm. This signal interference may be recognized because the signal changes are distinct compared to those of the respiratory cycle. If at any time the pulse oximeter reports zero, due to dropout or sensor disconnect, the entire respiration rate algorithm is reset. The Nelcor respiration rate algorithm monitors modulations of the pleth waveform due to the respiratory cycle, including baseline, frequency, and amplitude. Therefore, it can detect a change in respiration rate even if only one or two pleth modulations change. For example, if one patient demonstrates a change in pleth waveform baseline modulation, a respiration rate can be calculated based on that change. If a different patient demonstrates a change in pleth waveform frequency modulation, the algorithm can post an accurate respiration rate based on that data alone or in conjunction with a change in pleth waveform amplitude and or baseline modulation. With Nelcor respiration rate software, clinicians are now able to easily, continuously and non-invasively monitor a patient's respiration rate and changes that may be associated with respiratory compromise. This is all accomplished using the same technology, similar sensors and familiar workflow used in continuous pulse oximetry monitoring.